ಈ ಕಾರ್ಯಕ್ರಮದ ಪ್ರಾಯೋಜಕರು ರೈತ ಬಂಧು ಕುಚ್ಚಲಕ್ಕಿ ಸರ್ಪ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಲಿಬಾಸ್ ಟೊಕೋಟು ಅಣು ಮೊಬೈಲ್ ಟೊಕೋಟು ದೀಕ್ಷಾ ವಿಡ್ವೆಕ್ಸ್ ಕುಂಜತ್ತೂರು ಹಲೋ ಕಿಡ್ಸ್ ಹೌ ಆರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ ಫೈನ್ ಎಸ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ವೇಟಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಮೀ ಟು ಸಿಂಗ್ ದ ಸಾಂಗ್ಸ್ ಟುಡೇ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಬ್ರಾಟ್ ಅ ನ್ಯೂ ಸಾಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಯು ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅ ಫ್ಯೂ ಪಿಕ್ಚರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೆಟರ್ ಎಫ್ ದ ಪಿಕ್ಚರ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ದ ನೇಮ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಪಿಕ್ಚರ್ಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಬಿಗಿನ್ ವಿತ್ ದ ಲೆಟರ್ ಎಫ್ ಲೆಟರ್ ಸಿ ದೋಸ್ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ದೆನ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಸಿಂಗ್ ಯು ಅ ಸಾಂಗ್ ಓಕೆ ಲೆಟ್ ಸಿ this is letter f letter f says fa as in five number five yes letter f says fa as in fan ya look here letter f says f as in fingers f f you have to say f how f okay letter f okay f f says f f as in fun children are in fun here enjoying okay letter f says f as in fan fan okay letter f says f as in fly okay letter f says f right as in flower yes a letter f says f as in fish very good a letter f says f as in frog very nice okay this is letter f says f, f, f as in flamingo what is this flamingo yes repeat all the names with me okay tell this is letter f and its phonic sound is f we read f as f in words this this is what you should know clearly okay this is flamingo okay then frog fish flower fly yes this is fan you have fan at home fun you do fun with your parents and friends brothers and sisters yes fingers you have fingers in your hand five fingers in each hand two hands together you have 10 fingers okay this is a fan and this is number 5 number 5 begins with letter f very nice good job you know 
now many names words which begin with letter f so let us sing a song now i will sing a song of flag you know letter f says f as in flag this is our national flag we salute our national flag and our national flag has three colors saffron white and green and you can see there is a wheel in the middle of the uh, flag on white color which is blue in color it is known as ashoka chakra this is ashoka chakra it spins every day every second for progress that is why for the progress there is a chakra in between the flag okay let us sing the song tell i salute my flag it makes me proud i am an indian it says out loud three bright colors saffron white and green makes me glad the ashoka chakra blue on white spins for progress flying high flying high okay let's sing once again i salute my flag it makes me proud i am an indian it says out loud three bright colors adorn my flag saffron white and green makes me glad makes me glad the ashoka chakra blue on white spins for progress spins for progress flying high flying high flying high very good you have done very good job learn this song also thank you all i will come with some more activities in the next class thank you hi children how are you what are you doing you are waiting for me yes so i came back the thing just i wanted to revise the thing before that shall we sing a song okay today's our concept is alphabet okay a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s t u v w x y z so today's concept or subject is english see here i'm going to write the subject english e n g l i s h shall we start the session or shall we have some activity like singing dancing or something else okay we shall start now we have to sing a song of alphabets okay yes come little children come to me i will teach you a b c a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p l m n o p q r s t u v w x y z x y z butter on your bread if you don't like better go to bed 
Next Monday morning come to me. I will teach you A, B, C. Okay. Yes. You people have done to gather with me. Right. Yes. Have you enjoyed with me? Yes. Okay. Very good children. Now shall we start the lesson? Yes. Before starting the lesson just I wanted to revise what we have learned in the previous class. Anyone? Mm -hmm. Okay. See here. Now I have alphabets here. First one. See. You can see properly. A. This is A what we have learnt in the previous class. Here first one. What we have done? One slanting line, another slanting line and sleeping line. This one over and other next one B. Standing line, one curve and other curve. Even this also we have completed. The next one C. This is the last alphabet what we have learnt in the previous class. See, see here, very very easier. Only the thing you have to write or draw curve here. And the next one which we are going to learn today, D. I'll show you. This is D. Okay. Now we have to write. D here. You are getting confused. Yes. Don't worry. I will tell you how to write a alphabet D. Okay. For that first one here I am going to write here big D. First what you have to be done. First you have to draw a standing line after that one curve D is done ok first one standing line and the next step is only the thing is we have to draw a curve only two symbols or two strokes in English you have to be remembered here when we are very thorough in our strokes it is easier for us to write again I will tell you see here straight once your parents will write D in big letter after that see you have to trace or you have to write like this standing line straight see here like this you have to trace properly after writing a standing line later the second step is like this curve slowly you have to trace on this big D slowly like this like this like this like this and like this again shall we write how many times you have to write minimum 20 to 25 times you have to write like this after that it's easier for you to write yourself okay again I'll write slowly and gradually here just pay attention standing line standing line and here curve 
curve slowly and gradually you have to write like this d okay after writing 20 times like this my favorite kids you have to write d like this see one minute like this standing line curve directly you have to write yourself without the help of your parents standing line curve 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 this is what we have written a big letter alphabet d here okay once the first step like this you have to be written big d after that the second step is the children you have to be written like this and after writing first step and the next step next we are going to write the third step how to write big letter d in the four lines book okay yes i hope you people have written in your book okay don't you yes so now third step i'll erase the board and i'll write here what you have to do you have to take your four lines book to write a big letter d take your four line book four lines english copy book okay now see here now this is four lines book like this shall we draw the line here we shall draw the line here four lines but you people no need to draw a line because already you are having the four line copy book like this like this count the numbers here in the previous class i have taught you regarding the numbers right ha huh. now i am going to draw a line you have to count the numbers here how many lines are there one one line two lines three lines and four lines here straight straight and this one third line third line and this one fourth line okay this one fourth line now i'll write here the big alphabet d how to write standing line and curve like this 
and again standing line and curve 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 standing line and curve again standing line and curve here we have to be paid attention here we are having total how many lines first one line two lines three lines and the last one four lines always we should not write d like this see here like this we should not write only three lines we have to be used standing line d standing line d standing line d and the last one standing line and d this is the last method you have to write third method how to write the alphabet d here okay so you have to take your english copy book in that fully two page you have to write number sorry alphabet d here okay so what comes after d tell me a we have completed b we have done next c we have learnt and the next one d just now we have learnt the next one alphabet comes which is that alphabet e okay alphabet e so shall i erase the board yes okay i'll erase the board now see here alphabet e now how to write e hmm yes we do not know we did not write till now so obviously we will feel hmm difficulty to write alphabet e but here look at me as well look at the blackboard so that it is easier for you to write a alphabet e okay now big letter or capital letter e how to write first one standing line big e i am going to write here so first step is standing line after that tell me which line is this first class i have taught you regarding the line patterns so here i have drawn one line tell me which pattern or which strokes of english yes it is a sleeping line so once first step is standing line the next step sleeping line and the next step is sleeping line and at the end also we have to draw sleeping line okay lines always be drawn it's not be put some used to say line shall i put a line ma'am or shall i make a line ma'am no it's wrong always lines 
has to be drawn okay see first step again i'll tell you pay attention here don't go anywhere okay stay with me standing line standing line like this okay later at the beginning where we have started there only we have to draw which line sleeping line like this sleeping line and one line we have completed and other two sleeping lines are remained so we have to be drawn other two sleeping lines also so here second sleeping line see here second sleeping line okay first sleeping line we have done second sleeping line we have completed and the last one there is a end here of standing line so at the end point here we have to draw the last sleeping line like this okay so my kids has to be answered now how many sleeping lines are there how many sleeping lines are there first sleeping line one sleeping line then ah uh, second sleeping line and third sleeping line one two and third e is a capital letter in english which we can write like this with the help of how many strokes only two strokes first one standing line and other one is sleeping line this is the first method standing standing line and other one is which line i don't hear anything from you yes sleeping line so this is the first method which we can use to write the capital letter e now what you have to be done you have to be taken a slate okay you have to be taken a slate and you have to write big e like this if you can't write like this you take the help of your parents okay tell your papa mama brother sister uncle aunt there are many isn't it yes so you take the help of others and tell them to write a big yes e for you after that you have to trace or you have to write on the particular e how many times 22 25 times you have to write okay 22 how many times 25 times you have to write after writing the second stage or the second step is what tell me ha ah, you have to write yourself here how to write i will show you standing line sleeping line sleeping line sleeping line again standing line sleeping line sleeping line sleeping line again standing line sleeping line sleeping line again sleeping line the next standing line one sleeping line 
second slipping line, third slipping line, standing line, one slipping line, two slipping line, three slipping line, again standing line, one slipping line, two slipping line and three slipping lines. So, this is the second method how to write the big or capital alphabet E. So, after completing first method and second method, we will go for the third method which helps you to write properly in the four lines copy book. Okay. Take your four lines copy book children. Yes. Do you have? Yes. Very good. If you don't have four lines copy book, you tell your parents to get to you. Okay. So that you are able to write E. Okay. So, I will write here. You people no need to draw a line here because the lines already have drawn there. Okay. Now, the thing is how to write in four lines. This is the third method. Okay. Mm. Standing line. Here. See. Sleeping line. Sleeping line. Another sleeping line. Again. Standing line, one slipping line, two slipping line, three slipping line, standing line, one slipping line, two slipping line, three slipping line. Here in the second one standing line, one sleeping line, two sleeping line, three sleeping line, one standing line, one sleeping line, second sleeping line and third sleeping line. Why I have uh, written like this, tell me because this also in black color so if I write only one time you will not be able to recognize this properly so I have done like this you don't do like this only write like this standing line sleeping 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 standing sleeping sleeping and sleeping. So, this is the third method how we can write capital letter E. Okay. So, my kids, you have to write in your slates at the beginning and the next you have to be written in your four lines copy book. Okay. And one day you have to show me these things what you have written okay yes yes so now it's the term what i have to move from here okay so the next class will meet you again with lot of fun activities and dance okay now yes yes bye bye